Hello everyone. I hope everyone had a good holiday. And today we are gathered to discuss if the new trend of podcasts formats is actually valuable for the viewer or not. Robert? Thank you, sir. I think that the podcast is actually valuable for the viewer because it can help you to get a different perspective on the topic. No. While I understand your point, the overall algorithm on YouTube and other video platforms is limited to your bubble. What I mean by that is, for example, on YouTube, the algorithm suggests videos similar to your search history. This inevitably will lead to you being in a bubble where you don't hear another perspective. Interesting so far. Mike, any ideas? Hmm. Oh, man. <laughs> I got everyone. <laughs> but I think it is valuable for people who are new to a particular subject flash topic. This can definitely lead to an increase in knowledge so you can form an opinion. That makes sense, but this can also lead you to spouting an opinion of a podcaster no matter how uninformed or wrong it is. Agreed. That's why it's better to always inform yourself as well and not just listen to podcasters, but also read books and facts. Wow. I never thought we would agree on something. Well done. Nevertheless, I have invited Joe Rogan to give his opinion on this matter. Hello, Joe. Great to see you and congratulations. We just discussed if the podcast format is actually valuable for the average viewer or not. Any opinion on that? We're in, we're in Narnia now. We're in La La Land. You're, yeah. you're, you're, you're not being real. What the fuck? I just don't think you know who the fuck you are. A few moments later.